Are you done, Pat? Are you quite done with your with your with your astral pouch aerial maneuver? Okay, let's move on here. Uh, so we actually have our all. This is where we can look at all of our different powers as well. Uh, the power slash, which is the little striking maneuver, uh -huh. rejuvenation to revive things, uh -huh. and the sunrise, which causes the sun well Ooh. to do just that. We actually have a bunch of powers that'll be available to us by Let's the end see. of the game. How can I make these into <laughs> sexual things? Uh, don't worry, give it time. Power slash. There's a travel guide which huh. lets us look at. <laughs> it's a really muscly vagina as a power slash. Anyway, go on. <laughs> this travel guide is kind of like a little tutorial type briefing where you can go uh -huh. and read through different tips of how to play the game well. Cool. Logbook lets you know exactly what you're supposed to be doing right now. Right now we're doing nothing, apparently. Beastiary. And then the bestiary, which I always <laughs> thought was really cool, because you can actually go in and see some of these... Um, oh, the enemies. Yeah, and the neat paintings that they kind of give you that the brief glimpse of. of. Nice, yeah. Right. Rude monkey-like creatures that harass and tease humans. Whether frightening the locals or causing outbreaks of disease, these troublemakers have proven to be the bane of humanity. Like Said to hide in gloomy rude. places, they are portrayed as flautists. What? I like how it's rude. You're so rude. They're not dangerous. They're not fucking like, oh, oh they're rude. Yeah. These yeah. little bitches over here are rude. They all monkeys and they just come up to us and they just fucking rude. Oh my God. They just start messing in things and you just so don't even rude. believe it. Well, I mean, it really does sound like they're mostly harmless except <laughs> for bestiary. Yeah. <laughs> what do we have here? Spirit Globus. Okay. Humanity's faith made solid. Restores a little solar energy. Way to go. I think that probably just heals us one little bead, mm -hmm. if I had to guess. Ooh. It's a rock. Is that something buried? It's a rock. I don't think I have the ability to dig as of yet. Nope. Curiosity begs the question what that'll be when I do. It's a rock. It's a tree. Nah. Aww. Can you I just... You can't do anything about that yet. Rejuvenation? Silly no. goose. Damn! Look, I just want to try, okay? I just want to try. Uh, uh, and now I'm going to feed these boids. <gasps> oh. Look at that! Look at it! The bird loves us because we're feeding it! It's so pretty. Pat, it's so goddamn pretty. We take it to a magical land, and we're just going to leave it here, away from all of its family and friends that it raised and knew. Give me the goddamn bite seed. Nobody gets hurt. <laughs> it's so adorable. And I think... That gives us a little bit of faith, yep. Oh. Yay! You're so filled with love. I know. Compassion. And oh, we didn't actually so, kill them. So gay. <laughs> so gay. Which is great. Yeah. Which is fucking great. What the fuck happened there? We tossed him over here, remember? Oh, look at his little... Face down, ass up. Face down, ass up. Face down, ass up. <laughs> <laughs> it seems as though he's hurt just a little bit. Can't do anything with him right now. Can I? Star. Can I sunrise him? Uh, whoa. Nope. Nope. It, it it tried to do a little hocus pocus. Hey, glue but it for didn't a little glue glowed. <laughs> Clone. We can bite him. Why would you? Oh. Uh, stop biting him. No. I want to harass him. I bite. This guy, stop. if he if he wasn't such a dick little and wearing doggy, a basket on his stop. head, I would quit biting him. Doggy, stop. I just want to put my little flu. Oh, I feel it. I tend to say, thou beast dwell within this place. <laughs> Concentrate. Look hard, you see. Right behind you now. Mr. Orange? Oh! Oh! <laughs> he manifested oh. some demons for me to fight. Look at that. So special. Okay, so can I get all three of them at the same time? <clears throat> I cannot. No, you can't, because you just fucked that up. <clears throat> it looks like you only got one, you goddamn plebe. <laughs> and the other one is... Dead. Yep, yep. gone. Yep, he just died on his own, willy-nilly, without any help from me. Ooh, but you got 120 in. I know, and now I got 820 from the bonus, and it because it doubles my score. Oh my god. Humans are now in such battles I saw. The fighting went on for exactly 16 seconds. Way to fucking go. Hey, look. <laughs> when you're good, you're good, okay? <laughs> you don't have to last a long time when you get the job done quick. You know what I'm saying? to fight three guys? God, you're so slow. Oh, no. Ah, you gotta fight. Oh, So I again. talked to him again, 
and it made another fight of the, Is this just a practice thing, or is this a thing that you have to do? Possible. I don't know. Like, because... I mean, I understand that at the beginning of the level, you want to, like, be like, yo, get used to some battle. Here's some dudes. Here's a dude that we can just come bring back dudes every time. That actually earned me a lot more money. 1060. Literally. You know what? I'm okay with this. We're okay. just going to keep farming up some money. Give me some witnesses such battles when I saw it. The fighting went on for exactly 13 seconds. Hey, wow. You got three seconds better. Nice. Man. I'm so proud of you. Nice. What about you, Mr. Orange? Uh, nope. Still the same thing. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. I didn't mean my to throw you so far. Ass. <laughs> We're just gonna sit here and do a bro gun. My for a glorious saying ass. <laughs> That's actually a really good Vegeta voice. <laughs> I am I am very impressed with you, Pat. <laughs> Hello, Mushi Mama. <laughs> <laughs> Mushi Mama. Yeah. Woo! Oh, wait, no. It's Mushi's yeah, Mama. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> but I like her better as Mushi Mama. Mushi Mama. I think we're going to go with Mushi Mama. Okay. Uh, as in, Mushi is this guy's last name. I got, so. I got nothing other than Vegeta, so you go ahead and do this. I've had just about enough of this. I don't know if it's stray dogs or monsters or what, <laughs> but someone up. keeps messing with my crups. Going around digging holes with the squ with the triangle button. <laughs> Almost said the with square the button. With the circle square button. Oh fuck. PlayStation button. <laughs> it makes me so mad. If I catch you digging around here, you'll get a good thumping. Yes, you Man, will. Lady, by golly, gosh. You're really, really angry. Now is that Mushin? What, what was what was what was the name? Mushies. Mushies. Mushi. So is that Mushi over there? Oh, this is how we, we dig. dig. We dig with the triangle button. Oh, she's mad. She is in fact mad. We you... consumed a turnip. Miss, you might, you might have upset somebody there. Whee! Oh yeah, look at she go, look at her little fucking legs flying towards <laughs> you. We're gonna run away and then she's gonna be perplexed as to where the hell and we went. And there we go. <laughs> so I think that means I'm gonna go back up here and dig out that thing because I totally forgot about how to dig. Way to fucking go. Yeah, shut up, Pat. Way. You know what? If you helped me remember all the things about this game, Shugo. then you would be the one actually playing. You want me to memorize things? <laughs> And hold them in your brain for two weeks, Pat. Yes, that <laughs> yeah, is, no. that's what I want you to do. Yeah, no, that's, that doesn't happen Not anymore. Where, where? I know it was over here. Not since the accident. What accident? You said that so seriously. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, well, I have no joke anymore. <laughs> oh, you broke the horse! It was a Trojan horse, Pat. It was meant to bring wow. enemy coins in here. Enemy coins. <laughs> yes, there are such things as enemy coins. Shh. Coins. You gotta watch what side they stop on. <laughs> you never know whose side tails. they're gonna land on. Uh, they're so flip floppy. <laughs> <laughs> you always got a 50 50 chance of it being on your side. Peak comedy. Oh, <laughs> shut up. That was, I thought that was actually really funny. <laughs> oh, man, lady again. Why she sad? Uh, because we still want to return. singing. Hello, Rice Maiden. Oh. Kushi. Kushi. She's, she's wearing little ricees on top of her head. Well, what Those a, a rice fine bundles. looking wolf. What's your name? My name's the Amaterasu. <laughs> Mine's Kushi. It's a pleasure to meet you. Is it now? Yep. Hello, rice maiden. Sake brewer Kushi. Oh. That's why she's nice. making rice. That's why she's pink, too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yep. That's it. Working in the fields again, are you? Isun, are you and the wolf together? Uh, no, not, not quite that way, dear, but, you know. This is where I go the rice for making my sake, you know. But I have to manage the harvest all on my own. It's hard work. Maybe I should have Susano give me a hand against Susano. Susano. Oh, Susano. listen to me blabbering on. I just can't help chatting to you. Susano dono. Well, come and help me. I'm just doing your Valley Girl voice, and then all of a sudden breaking into a Japanese, just straight <laughs> yeah. up Japanese voice. <laughs> Why, Amy? I think you found a new friend here. You'll meet many people who want to talk to you like this. You should talk to them two or even three times. Being a god and all, you can actually tell when to talk because you see the triangle above their head. <laughs> Is that what being a god means? Yeah, basically. It's like, oh, here's my opportunity to. It's it's because it's it's the Sims version of being a god. Fair you point. see the triangle over people's head. Mm, ta da! Yep. You can do a thing. It's it's a reasonable explanation for quest markers. Okay. 
<laughs> they may just be muttering to themselves, but it pays to listen. Whoa, you scary. You I scary did. I dog. scared her. Xana's a neighbor of mine. He's a little unusual, but he goes around with a huge sword slung over his shoulder. Can you throw it over your shoulder like a continental sword? <laughs> he's always low. practicing with it. Yeah, I'll bet he is. They say he's a direct descendant of our legendary hero, Nagi. <gasps> and he loves his sake, too. Yeah, I'll bet he does. He often pops around here to plow it in my... Well, around here to buy it. <laughs> I was just about to make the joke. Does he love the sake or does he love the sake uh, waitress? But still. <laughs> To plan my sick boss. Anyway, <laughs> although I guess she's kid. not. She's the she's the full intense brewer, and a doggy. Hello, so fellow pup. Sniff the butt. Oh! oh! I can pick up this other doggy. Okay. Well, there can only that be one in this town. Poor thing. Put we know what's gonna happen. Oh God! Put me down. Oh no. Oh! Did you just drop it in the fucking water? No, I wasn't able to take it with me oh. when I jumped. God. Damn it. I was hoping. What? Um, what? <laughs> He's the same I size guess I'll be as able you. To find it later. Yeah, I know. How was I able to pick him up so easily? We are a god. Oh, okay. This is Mushi, and his there mom was over there. She got mad at us for digging up the her, digging up her prized tinnums. Hmm. <laughs> a white wolf. Now that's just plain weird. Sure looks like a weak little bugger. Think you could beat my dog, Hayabusa? Well, well listen to this. There's the field my mom attends to you, you see. Well, Hayabusa managed to dig up nine turnips in a row, even though my mama was chasing him around trying to slug him. There's actually ten turnips in that field. Hayabusa is fixing to get all ten. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's just a fun voice to do. It really <laughs> yeah. is. Think you can dig up all the turnips in my mama's field? Huh. Don't forget. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> that did sound a little dirty. Don't forget, you have to avoid being slugged by my mama. I'll admit, you're a better canine if you do it. Ah, she's gonna try and slug us. I'm more of a flea type person myself. I don't know if I can be so selfish as to be slugged around all the time. At least you have your celestial brush and wicked brush stroke. Yeah, go stroke it. So curiosity begs the question though, what, so are you digging what up the brush thing? stroke would be able to help me here? Like, oh. can I just cut her in half? Like, is that a thing that I can do? Maybe you can like, Block her or something? I don't fucking. Is there like a happy? Oh, yep. oh you fucking slashed at her! I do. I just literally cut the she woman is in a half. Mother? Well, at least she's not pregnant. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> circle around her or something? Oh, I totally forgot. You can you can move the camera when you pause time to uh, do the the brush. Ah, okay. So like I can do this uh, and then turn around. There you go. There you go. And you get in the proper angle. Okay, so are you planning to kill her, kill her? Like, what's I don't going think on? so. I think that I just have to kind of stall her long enough. So the goal here is get all the turnips. Yeah, get all the fucking turnips before she can she can bop us on the nose. Gotcha. We Run. are we are um oh god uh you... the little bunny poo poo hopping through the forest. Poo -poo. Wow. Well, she's little bunny poo poo hopping through the forest. Picking up the field mice and popping me on the head. Hey, God there damn you it. Go. Yep, nope, you just lost it. You just fucking lost it. I know. I actually was going to be able to do it that time, too. Okay. Wow, all of them. Yeah, yeah. You gotta do it. Here's the thing that dog yeah. is actually a very special dog. Is so, he a turnip getting dog? Yes, he is a very prized turnip getting dog. Sweet. He is Japan's foremost turnip retriever. I mean, that's like their biggest industry, right? Exactly. Everybody knows that. Yeah. Oh boy, I think I just kind of got kind her of wet there. Stupid. With ink, not Pat. Get your mind out of the gutter. Because <laughs> I know you were thinking Shut it, you up. dirty, dirty no. old man. No, I never. Oh, yep. Yeah, just old covered man. her in ink. Oh wow, that's uh, like a squid. Well, that wasted her for a while. It actually kind of did. I'm. Wait, so what was, how did you do that? Like, what was the, did I just kind of her? ended up inked over her, yeah. Like so, and then it. Nope, that nope. didn't do it at all. She's gonna boop you. She's gonna try. Quick, threaten her kid. <laughs> <laughs> I got him hostage. <laughs> you, you let me take all this turnips or else he gets it. If you ever wanna see your boy alive again, <laughs> I'll draw him into a sunset, so help me. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> 
giant page brush just comes through the screen, just smacks the kid into the sky. I know, right? <laughs> and we're out of ink. Up, we're out of ink, Pat. Up. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, there we go. Sweet. Oh, I I just kind of noticed that when we run out of ink, we actually kind of lose our mystic luster. Yeah, yeah, your little flamey thing goes down. Yeah, it's pretty intense. It's gonna get you. It's gonna get you. It's gonna get me. Oh, oh no, it's black now. <laughs> Quick, <laughs> Pat. <laughs> She's, she's black now. Quick, do something about that. Wait, what? <laughs> I didn't realize that Estelle Getty was oh, in this game. Oh, look at it. Oh, boy. A, wait, is she going to get you still? She's still going to try, but I need Are to get that 10th turn up. Okay, that 10th turn up? 10th is oh. what I said. There we go, and, and we're going to return little... it back to him. Little oh, and I chopped down the tree in the background. Do you see that? You oh, you fucking accidentally did it. I was like, wait, how did that work? We offered him the oddly shaped turnip. Hey, that's, that's, uh... The oddly shaped turnip Hayabusa <laughs> and I've been looking for. Says what it is, man. I know, right? Says what it is. It's just right there on the tin. That means <gasps> you've broken Hayabusa's record by digging up all ten turnips? Boogazua. Gosh darn it. Yeah. <laughs> Golly bum gee willikers. Fucking shit. <laughs> <laughs> Mushi's mom comes up. I'm going to bop you one. <laughs> I'm going to bop you one, good kid. Anyway, it actually feels good to have a new goal to aim for. And we got some, uh, faith. Oh. Yeah. Yippee. Sniff the butt. Wait, so what was special about this fucking dog? I guess you'll have to wait and see. Oh, cool. Yeah, I know. My favorite kind of surprise is the Little wait melon. and see kind. Oh, watermelon. My favorite. Nope. It's a chicken. It's, it's a oh, chicken. I bit oh, the you chicken. got the chicken. I bit the chicken. Oh. <laughs> Did you ever have to kill chickens as a kid? Uh, I did actually. Yeah. My my uh my family has a farm up in South Carolina where we had a whole bunch of guinea fowl. Oh. Okay. And so yeah, that's yeah, what yeah, I had yeah, to deal yeah. with. Get close. Nice. Yeah. No. When I was growing up, uh, kind of in the ghetto, if you will. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Uh, we had chickens everywhere. Um, but that was like the normal thing. Mm. Like so. But for dinner, like we'd have to go kill the chickens for us. Uh. In order for us to eat, obviously. So, like, my grandmother would send me out. No, back. you just kill chickens for fun. Yeah. No. You know, for Santeria rituals. Well, <laughs> you need the blood. <laughs> the feathers actually it make really great pillows. me. <laughs> um, you need the cock for the cock. You keep your youthful luster. Yeah. No, You're no, actually no, no. 137 years old. I am actually a giant chicken. <laughs> um, that's why I have such big thighs. Ah. No, yeah, but uh, she would have us go out back, and, like, the way we would kill a chicken is we would hold it by the head. And then, like, do a quick snap with your arm. So that way the, the neck would break. Oh my god! Yeah, so you just grab it, like, off the ground and you'd be like, Whaka! And just, like, and then it would just go limp and you'd be like, Alright, here's dinner. That is horrific and violent! And then we go inside and then we clean it off and then we cook and eat it. And then there you go. Oh my god! Yeah. I've heard of people kind of like doing a, a just a once over and a lasso type over their yeah, head. Yeah, that's what I mean. It's just like it's big. Whip. Same? Yeah. 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 See, because either that or, like, grab by the body and, like, smash the head against something, but I didn't like doing that because that seemed so much more violent and, like, took time. Why wouldn't you just, like, hold the neck down and then go at it with a cleaver? That's the deal. It's, so it's just like, nah, just fucking, like, grab its fucking neck and just go snap. Fair enough. Then, I guess I guess if you kill it before you chop its head off, you don't get chicken running around with its head cut off syndrome. Usually. Yeah. You do get some of the residual movement sometimes. Yeah. Oh, that's the creepiest. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Which, if you're not used to it, it's a really big shock, but once you get used to it, it's fine. It's okay. The only shocking part is that's the residual electricity going through their muscles. Yeah. Yeah. That's God, it's, it's so... life slowly drains away. Oh, God. It's the creepiest fucking thing. We did that with frog's legs in high school. Oh, yeah. Where we yeah, actually yeah, took yeah. little electrodes. Did you ever, like, move the tendon? Uh, no, we, we would actually take little oh, electrodes you tend and the, pulse oh, wow, the muscles, cool. and they would actually tense. Like, it was crazy pain. I like going up to people with the detached frog leg and, like, pulling on the tendon to make it kick. Uh. <laughs> so I would just go up to somebody's face and be like... <laughs> you get two fun. of them and you just do Michigan yeah, State Frog. it's fucking great. <laughs> or, uh, and or then everybody just... looks at you like you're some fucking weirdo. <laughs> I know, right? Like, I mean, you know... And like, why wouldn't They're you the ones with the problem, not me. Absolutely. Jesus Christ, Pat. <laughs> Do they still dissect frogs in, in school? I hope so. I hope like, that that's something that didn't kind of go by the way. I mean, well, like, how? why would you need it, though? Um, like, imagine a, wor imagine a world. Mm. 
like, so imagine everybody has an iPad in class. Like, at that point, it's an app game. Mm hmm. Where you just like, okay, slice down here. Oh, it's wait, almost a Wii game. Uh, hold on to that story real quick. This is actually a big uh, story point here. We're about to meet Susan o. Oh, she. Susan? Sweet. Hi, yeah. Susan. She's sleeping right now. Oh. This is the home of the two bit middle aged warrior, Susan o. Sorry, Susan. He goes around claiming to be a descendant of Nuggy. <laughs> he's famous around here for being his lineage, but he's awfully lazy and too off the wall to be a descendant of a legendary Too hero. off the wall. He's two crazy characters <laughs> for our story. Yeah, I know. We have the peach goddess and the sun goddess and it's... a little flea right on top of your head. He's just crazy. It's a broken sword. Oh, it's a pot. Oh, it's, it's a staircase. It's a hole. Ladder. <laughs> staircase. Well, I mean, in case you remember, this is kind of Legend of Zelda-ish, so of course there would be little hidden holies in the ground. <laughs> Susan O'Donnell is currently sleeping. I am the greatest. Nah, I'm doing it. Okay, fine. I'm doing this. By all means, go ahead. <laughs> Whoa, it looks like he ain't waking up anytime soon. Is that a wet spot I see underneath him? What a weird dream to be having. <laughs> Oh, Yoshi, that's true. Hmm. What if I bump it? Ah. Hmm. <laughs> if that didn't wake him up, nothing will. That's sweet, Kush. Kush. <laughs> Kushi, she that's breeds sweet sake. Sweet Kush. <laughs> oh, that beautiful, beautiful Kush. That dank herb. <laughs> what a great time to live in Colorado, Japan. <laughs> <laughs> you know Japan is actually incredibly, incredibly hard. Oh, I thought you were saying. Did you walls. know Japan is incredibly popular in Colorado? <laughs> uh, wait. So wait. One more time. What did you just they say? They are incredibly strict on marijuana laws. That doesn't like, surprise me. It is completely locked down there. Like it's that a black market drug over. amongst all. That's weird. That really is weird. This is weird. My mind really wants to shift this rock, but my body won't cooperate. It's like I'm made of lead. Could this be a case of demonic possession? I sure hope not. No, it's just a giant fucking boulder. I can't boulder. move this boulder, therefore it must be the devil. I should write <laughs> Religion. Oh, a musician fucking monster. Who's I know, he's, he's got a Japanese he's guitar. A and he slapped his red behind that. He did. He did. That was I forget rude. what that's called. The the Japanese guitar. Do you know what that's called? Uh, it's got a special name. Uh, no. Oh, the sitar? No. No, it's, I think sitar's Indian. Sitar's something else. Yeah. I have no idea. Yeah. I am not so musically Suck it, culturally nerds. different. Oh shit! Oh wait, shit! He put himself back. Yeah, he, he blocked it. No, this guy back here blocked mine. There we go. Oh, okay. So I just didn't go through it all. Well, look at you, you fancy fuck. I know. Oh, flowers. Come on, get him while his ass is in the air. Oh wow, what the hell? There we go. I guess my line just wasn't straight enough, Whee! Pat. Well. Yep. I know. It's a constant sometimes problem. Sometimes you can be a little crooked. It's it's a constant problem that I have. And now we restored this area too. Oh boy! I know. We get a little bit more faith. Oh, what the fuck? And actually, we can level up one of our things. Oh boy! We accumulated praise. Oh boy! I keep Whoa, saying oh boy. Why? <laughs> you suddenly started glowing. That means your divine attributes can be enhanced. <laughs> well, you sure look excited. Here, I'll show you what I mean. Let's take a stab at enhancing your divine attributes. You're more in God's faith now. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> You're Since getting... you did more work for me, that means God loves you more. You're a level two one grand wizard. <laughs> and now uh... we can level up her life energy. Oh boy. Yay. You can live longer in order for God to kill you. And I think we'll see what that does on the next episode. Yay. Later. I'm going to try and use this as a sink. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yay. Oh. Oh, you lie inside of it didn't hurt at all. This will. Oh, we. Whoa. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, you're not. I am. I'll donate to a spouse abuse shelter. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs>